How's everyone doing today? It's CJ Alec with Vision Net Media, and today I wanted to show you a really cool uh, and, in my opinion, a must-have plugin for WordPress, which it is called Zamanta, and it's Z-E-M-A-N-T-A, -A, as you can see right here on the right. And what it does is it actually pulls from the content that you have typed into your blog post and or page and pulls suggested images and related articles for you to actually share and embed into your blog post. Um, for example, go ahead and get rid of that while I'm here so I can show you. Um, this is just a real small you know, beginning of a, a blog post that I'd done on how to add pictures to WordPress um, and one of which is specifically for this video but <clears throat> excuse me if you just you know select where you want the image to be put um, you got find the picture that you want these are just pictures that the plugin has pulled specifically based upon the content that you have in your uh, copy or, or or you know your content if you will um, so I'm going to pick the WordPress you know full out logo uh, you could do you know set as featured insert in the post or you can just click the image to insert in the post and then from there you know you can always go and select where you want it select the size and you can change the caption um, it's a personal choice, um, you know, be smart when you do this and know that most images that are online are copyrighted. So anytime you use an image, you want to make sure that you do leave some type of credit. And most of the time it will leave a photo credit of where they're pulling the image from. So you can do that once that's finished you simply click done. Um, if you want to continue to edit more, you can go into edit image. And then from there, you know, it has all this other stuff. And you can go in and um, as you can see, I've done this once before just to make sure I wasn't in the middle of doing something and uh, it completely looking crazy when I'm trying to show you guys how this works uh, and also it's a personal choice uh, as well if you wanted to leave the link to the actual file source um, sometimes I do most of the time I don't like to you know in which case you just click none um, you do link to image where it goes to the actual image current link which goes to the you know the page most of the time that the files on most of the time I don't like my pictures to go to something else simply because it takes them off and away from the content and sometimes it doesn't always work out good for the reader so that being said you just simply update and there's your picture um, and if you get to wanting to add additional I guess you could say content you simply once you finish and you know sincerely your name whatever down at the bottom you know if you want to select three or four blog posts over here on the right that you think is going to be good for your readers put them in and it's you know it'll give you a quick rundown on related articles um, the big thing with Zamanta is you can put in your own sources um, for instance I haven't done that many blog posts, if you will, on WordPress itself as far as content or plugins or anything like that. So I'm not having anything of my sites actually show up. But if you write a lot on a certain con um, content niche, you know, whatever category, whatever you want to call it, um, related topic, then your other posts will stay here and the big huge plus to that is it allows you to keep for instance if they finish reading a blog post and you know what you're talking about you're not sitting there 
just throwing fluff on your website to try to say that you blog um, and you have stuff that's relevant then when they come to the bottom of it of the site and they see see three related articles that are on your site it keeps you know keeps people on your site and it keeps them looking through content that they want to see so I strongly recommend that you use this or use that concept that being said um, and also you have this selection you have a choice um, as soon as you use the plugin it automatically puts this image in your post you can cancel it out if you want to it's completely up to you uh, other than that I'm trying to think if there's anything else I would say this is a great plugin you need it but we'll not touch any other plugins at that point um, that being said that's Zamanta um, like I said it's probably one of my top 10 most used plugins easy of of easy top top 10 maybe even top 5 most used plugins for WordPress uh, and I guess I'll have to do a complete post on my top you know favorite plugins and share that as well at one point but I'll put that on the note board if I forget please come back and yell at me and tell me to get on it that being said hope everyone enjoys their Wednesday um, it's like uh, 7 30 ish for me I gotta get going I have uh, uh, some stuff I gotta get get to so that being said hope everyone enjoys the rest of your day if it's not Wednesday when you're watching this, enjoy that day too. And as always, be great and stay boosted. Have a good one.